in today's video it's going to be a quick layout update of what's been happening during the month of january 2019. So what's been happening in January 2019 on my escarpment layout, I've got all the point motors, all 33 in place, they're installed, they're under the bench work, ready to go. I've also started on my southern end helix. This will go from level one up to level two. I will have separate videos coming out on the helix itself. I've also started uh, experimenting with my control panels. One of them, it's quite compressed with a lot of stuff, a lot of switches, a lot of LEDs I'm going to have to fit into it. So I'm now I'm sort of considering whether I actually blow that up from an A4 up to an A3. And so will that switch panel or that control panel be larger than the other one? So I'm dabbling with that and I think I will go that way. So what's this space? And obviously I will have some separate videos on that once I get some traction. I've actually hooked up my MRC Wi-Fi and I'm going to show you that, give you a quick demo of it as well and uh, run a train off my smartphone. Here we are at the southern end. This is the, the first of two helixes and basically this will go up from level one up to level two. 500 millimeters between the levels give or take. Each tier will be 100 mil. I will be having a couple of extra additional supports uh, for each part from the center to the outer edge about 920 millimeter that's roughly 36 37 inches uh, so that should give me a nice diameter for the trains to run up and keep uh, the incline uh, down to definitely below 1.8 degrees. Now I am tossing up at the moment. I've only roughed this in. This is not permanently in place. It's just screwed down into the baseboard. So right now, before I get too much further, I'm going to make a decision whether or not I stick to this standard plywood material or I upgrade uh, to a, a, I don't know whether it's a double A or a triple A marina plywood. So look, that's just a decision I need to make so I can get on with this job. So now I thought I'd just show you my MRC Wi-Fi setup. So here you can see this is the MRC Wi-Fi box there. Uh, basically, it just plugs straight in to my wireless system. This is an older system, and I think with the newer ones that are coming out of late, they have more input jacks. Well, I've only got one here, so I've sort of had to put this splitter in so I can then charge my cab controller as well as having the Wi-Fi connected. One of the pros with this is I really want the whole layout to be wireless. I don't really want to have the cabs plugged in and out around the, the layout. I want to make sure, you know, if, if anyone's coming over to operate, they can just walk around freely without being tied to a, a physical line. And also one of the other bonus to buy more of the MRC Prodigy wireless cab, they're 200 plus dollars each. The Wi-Fi bought it once, I think it was probably a little bit over a hundred dollars. Anyone can come in with a smartphone hook into it and control a train or two. Here we are, I've now got the Wi-Fi set up. My phone's connected to the MRC Prodigy Wi-Fi system. As you can see here, it's pretty much on my screen there. Now I'm just going to connect to it and you can see here, this is going into the engine driver software. So I'll go in, do a select, I'm now on the DCC address. I don't have any of the JMRI roster stuff set up just yet. Uh, that'll be something down the track. Uh, what I'm gonna do is plug in the address. The engine in front of us is a, a 48 class. So it's 4821. Do the acquire and I'm pretty much ready to go now. So um, what we're gonna do, I'll show you quickly. I guess we'll go to F8, get the sound on. the horn, get the light on, now we'll move off forward 
And as you can see, everything sort of happens instantly. There's no delay. It's quite a good little system. Now I'm just going to bring it back, I've put it into reverse and we'll get it going backwards now. So there you have it, that's just a quick demo. There's a bit of a quick update of what's sort of been happening during the month of January 2019. Until next time, bye for now.